Here I am on the Jurassic Coast during the winter months of 2019. I found a really nice green ammonite nodule in a gully down near the sea. You can see the back of the ammonite, the keel of the ammonite, actually protruding out of the stone. That's what alerted me to the fact there was a fossil in the rock. Then it was prepared lovingly and patiently by at Stone Barrow Fossils. Lizzie Hingley did the work to prepare the fossil out of the rock. You can see small ammonites there washed up against the main entity. The little ammonites washed up against that big ammonite as it acted as a barrier and an obstruction on the sea floor. A green ammonite nodule from the, the Jurassic Coast. Just showing you how with a chisel you can get down into the green to see what's in there, whether it's a Antotrinoceros or a Phagophilosteros ammonite. But in this case, it does look like a Phagophilosteros. You can just see there part of the edge of that. Lizzie Hingley preparing round a fossil ammonite contained within a green ammonite nodule. The ammonite itself is called Androgynoceros. She's carefully penning away the rock, away from the outer world of the fossil specimen, revealing more and more of it as she goes. It's very careful work that she's doing here. The specimen I found in the winter of 2019 was carefully prepared during the months up to the summer. And now, at the end of the summer, I can reveal this lovely specimen that I found repaired by Lizzie Hindley. So this piece you can see with those wonderful ammonites does take hours of work to get them so beautifully prepared. I, on the walks out along the Jurassic coast at low tide, take quite a bit of time to do the filming. I hope to get out along the beaches with some really good tides coming up soon and produce some more films.